Well, hello. Welcome to day 39. That's February 8th of our uh, The One Year Bible Devotion Video Series thing. <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. Glad you're here. Um, the block of scripture for The One Year Bible, that's going to be Exodus 28, 1 through 43, Matthew 25, verse 31 through 26, verse 13, Psalms 31, verse 9 through 18, and Proverbs 8, 12 through 13. Uh, so today I just wanted to look at one of these Psalms. Um, the Psalms 31, I wanted to look at verse 9 and 10. 9 and 10 of 31, it says this. Be gracious to me, O Lord, for I am in distress. My eye is wasted from grief, my soul and my body also. For my life is spent with sorrow, and my years with sighing, my strength fails because of my iniquity, and my bones waste away. David's not in a very pleasant place, and uh, there's times we all get there where we cry, we mourn, we grieve, we struggle. We're just fatigued and exhausted. There's, we just have this, this daunting thought of, are we going to make it through the next thing that life throws at us? Um, and we just get exhausted, both mentally, spiritually, emotionally, just physically exhausted, where our life is just spent. I want to encourage you with this, though. Out of a psalm that doesn't sound very encouraging in that small little, little piece we took. But you're not alone. You're not by yourself. We, we all get there sometime. I might be in it today. You might be in it tomorrow. Or vice versa. But the key is, we have other believers around us that can help encourage us and share the burden. I just want to want to let you know you're not alone. Find somebody you can reach out to. Find somebody you can talk to. Somebody that can encourage you. We, we have to have that. And ultimately, remember that when you feel like you're sinking, like you're spent, remember that we serve Jesus, when the ship feels like it's sinking, he's the one that can quiet the storm. Just lean into him. Spend some time praying and asking him to strengthen you, to encourage you, to give you what you need for today. Don't worry about tomorrow. <laughs> Tomorrow's got plenty of its own stuff to worry about. Just ask for provision for the day. And our loving God will provide you with what you need. Just remember today, guys, you're not alone.